This is going to be my largest doodle yet. So I've got my Posca paint pens, pretty much all the colors. And I'm gonna start with the black paint pen, draw flowy lines across the paper. This will create shapes and different sections for me to go back and color and doodle in later. Now, this one took me well over two hours to finish. So I am speeding this video up for y'all. And I broke this up into 30 minute chunks of my day spread throughout a single day. By the end of the day, my hand hurt y'all. And does anyone else do this where I'm, you can see I'm sectioning off the shapes and coloring in little squares inside the shapes. I'm curious if anyone else out there colors like that. And breaking this up into 30 minute time blocks was really fun. And I did a lot of art meditation today, it turns out. So I am making my Halloween costume, oh, spoiler alert. So that part will be fun. And I wanted to show you how sometimes I do these techniques and yes, there are moments of relaxation and satisfaction and my alone time, my meditation time, certainly. Sometimes it's also just fun. This was so much fun. The colors, the size, you know, it's different. Kind of broke me out of the huge. I'll admit I'm thinking during most of this, am I gonna be able to pull this off? Am I going to be able to wear this doodle the way I'm imagining? You shall find out very soon. So I've just about got all of these shapes colored in and I'm going to leave, like I said, I think I said, I've recorded this a couple times, but I'm going to leave some of the shapes open and just white. I think that white space feels really good. And I mean, my hand was hurting, so it also gave me a little break from coloring those last four shapes in. Now I'm taking my black paint pen and adding my doodle patterns. I'm doing the same pattern in each color. So you can see all the yellows, got the mermaid scales, all the pink shapes, got the polka dots, et cetera, et cetera. And this, because this piece was so large, this just saved me from having to brainstorm or think up, you know, all these different Zentangle or doodle patterns. And it kind of brings some balance into this piece. Okay, now I'm bringing in my white Posca pen, as you can already tell, and just adding some of those white details. I took the black paint pen and I'm retracing all of those black lines. And let's bring in our razor cutter. Okay, y'all, let's see if I can do this. Happy Halloween, and thanks for watching.